What's good, y'all? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's your girl, Trina here. I'm back again with another video. Before this video gets started, please subscribe to my channel, turn on post notifications, and go like all my recent videos. And let's get the video started. Today, I'm going to talk about um, a serious topic about kids. Like, um, if you got kids, then you might want to watch this video. You should never tell your child to fight another kid. If that kid hit your child, tell your, you want to tell your child to go tell the teacher or or a, a aide or anybody. Don't you shouldn't tell your child to hit another kid. That's not that's not teaching them. That's not teaching them nothing. That's not that's not teaching them. You making them to be a bully. That's how you making them be. Cause you telling them. If a child hit you, you better hit them back. No, no, no. You don't tell your child that. Why you you tell your child if, if a child hit them, you you tell your child you better hit you better you better hit that child back. You better hit them back. No, no, no. That's so wrong. Like it's you don't tell your child that. Show your child an example. Tell your child if a child hit them, go tell a teacher or go get somebody. Don't. Tell your child to hit them back. No, that's not teaching. That's not teaching them the right way. And sometimes these so-called kids get out of hand these days. They got all these iPhones, the iPads, and all that. If you eight or nine or ten years old, you don't need no iPhone, or iPad. You need to be learning. You need to be coloring. You need to be eating you know, coloring books. Okay. You need to be in them coloring books, not worrying about <laughs> no iPhone, or iPad. See, when I was growing up. I didn't see. I was around. See, around y'all age, I didn't have no phone. Not around y'all age. Nah, since this new generation is so messed up, these so-called parents want to get their child an iPhone, an iPad. Like, like, let your child, let your child learn. Let your child ex explore. Like, let your child go outside. Don't. Don't put don't put all these these devices in their faces and and sometimes kids be on their phone like hours and hours of the day. Like and y'all have to realize something like you don't have to get your eight or nine year old or ten year old an iPhone. No, like get them get them a little flip phone. They can do just fine. Do the same thing. Call. Call the grandma, call the grandparent, call the friend. That's do the same thing. A life on all, all only flip phone that had no no like we can download apps and all that. They don't need all that. All they need is a little flip phone and call their little friend or their grandparents or their aunties and uncles and then be done with it. But you have to teach your child how you was raised. You have to you have to teach your child back then you didn't have all these fancy things they getting that they got. Like you have to show them how how you can get the lady Jordans if you wanted to. So today these kids get the lady Jordan and get the latest Nikes, like whatever shoe brand you you think they got it. Because these parents get it for them. But these parents y'all need to teach your child how to save money and let them do chores around the house or let them go cut grass. Or let them work. Let them work for the money. Don't just go out there and buy them a. Don't just go out there. Don't don't just go out there and buy them a pair of shoes. Just let them work for it. Like you you can't you can't just be handing your kids. Oh here here a new pair of shoes like that. No, let them work for it. See back in the day, it was bad back in the day. Like you couldn't go out and buy the latest Jordans. You couldn't go out and buy the latest stuff like. Let your child know it's all these fancy things doesn't matter. Don't have to go to um Nike outlet to get, get clothes. Don't have to go to the mall. They can go. They can go right, right to Walmart or the Goodwill. That's the same thing. It doesn't matter. They it doesn't matter. Like you don't you don't have to go buy your kid expensive clothes. Like, cause some folks can't buy clothes. They can't buy no expensive clothes. They can't buy expensive shoes. You have to teach your child. You have to teach, you have to teach your child that fancy things don't mean nothing. It, it, it's not gonna make them popular if they get fancy clothes or fancy shoes or the latest iPhone. They can't be like their friends. Like you, 
you have to tell your child they can't be like their friends who can delay the iPhone every year. They if they if their phone is working good, then let them keep it. Don't just buy them the latest iPhone every year when a new iPhone comes out. Like you have to really teach your children how to be appreciative of things. Like they can't say, Oh mommy and daddy, oh can I get a new iPhone? They and y'all jumping and going and get it for them. Like, no, teach them how to say, no, you can't. You, you got a phone. Your phone is fine. There's nothing wrong with your phone. Just tell them that. But y'all want to be going, riding, riding the latest iPhone, the latest one. The new ones come out every year. Y'all want to run to, to Apple Store. Y'all running and going and getting it. Why? If that iPhone 6S still work, or the iPhone 8 or the iPhone XR, if they found, if it's still working, then let them keep it. Don't let's keep running and running and running, going and new latest. They, <laughs> your child can't have the latest technology every time something new comes out that your child wants it. If your child wants it, let your child work for it. Let your child earn it. You have to teach your child to earn it instead of giving, giving it to them all the time. Stop giving it to them and let them earn it for what they want. Thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. As always, stay blessed, stay beautiful, stay awesome, and stay you. Bye.